So I think it was the exposure that was screwed up when I went for my walk yesterday. That was yesterday. Today's today. It's about four o'clock in the morning, folks. And uh, I'm doing my thing. Yeah, I love drinking in the morning, especially on Sunday morning. Sunday morning is a good time for me to drink. But that's not the reason I started this video. The reason I started this video was I'm torn between trying to live, eat, and be healthy and enjoy life and eat good. I mean, eat what I like. Because, you know, to eat healthy and be, you know, that's just, you're not eating what you like. <laughs> I mean, it's just bullshit. It's bullshit. It's more expensive to eat healthy and to try to lose weight. If you want to lose weight, you got to eat healthy. Um, it's expensive. That food is expensive. And uh, it don't taste that great. I'm sure that people have figured out ways to eat healthy and still enjoy it, but I ain't figured it out yet. <laughs> I do like celery with ranch dressing, but my doctor says the ranch dressing isn't healthy. So I try, no matter what I try, every time I try to do something good, I always get shot down. So see what happened? I, I tried to open a can of, uh, what was I opening? Uh, it, never mind. Don't worry about it. It wasn't healthy. I was I opening a can of chili for hot hot dog chili. I was hoping that hot dog chili to go on a hot dog. So it wasn't healthy. And what happened? I cut my thumb because I, I was using them can't one of them damn can openers, and it's got a bad spot. It's it's not made for me. Obviously, it ain't made for nobody. Because if you do it wrong, you cut your thumb off. Anyhow, I'm torn between living healthy. Uh, I'm torn between I'm torn between being round for the rest of my life and or being trying to be slim, which ain't gonna happen. Trust me. Okay, I mean, people do it. I've seen results from people that have been really big to being really small. But you also have to think about the struggles and the crap that they've went through to get there, the sacrifices they've made to be small. All right. You've been miserable. You've lived miserably to get small, but you know what? You're still going to die. We're all going to die. So would you rather live a good, happy life or a miserable life? I'm not eating what I like. I'm still hungry kind of life. That's the way I'm thinking. I mean, it's the, I'm torn, folks. I'm pretty much torn. I want advice on this. My way of thinking is to just go ahead and enjoy life, eat what I want, and the hell with the consequences. But another part of me is, is also saying you've got to be able to figure out a way to do both. You got to be able to figure out a way to enjoy life and make it last longer. But, you know, there's things that I really am having trouble sacrificing. You know, it, it all comes down to the food, the foods that I like. And the drinks. <laughs> most of my weight, I'm sure most of my weight comes from these 32 ounces of alcohol that I drink daily. Yep. That's where a lot of my weight comes from. Cause that, that right there turned into sugar. So I am not very willing to sacrifice the things that I love for the body that I want. <laughs> this has gone on long enough. Folks, put your comments below. They won't go below until I accept them to go below because I have to weed out the bull crappers and the, you know, the haters got to weed them out. Can't let them, can't let the bad comments go through. So, uh, and if you edit your comment, I'll see that too. So don't even try it. Anyhow, I am just, I'm torn when I'm done with that drink for breakfast. I'm going to have a frozen pizza.